Uh, okay, um, welcome to animation day one. And today we are starting from zero. We are starting to import the character to Icron 7.7. .7. And today I will only show you how to animate this character how to add your animation to character so without wasting time let's get in so i have here i come here first of all like this window here is content sometime you might open your um computer and you find that here is smart gallery if you go to smart gallery you can double click there and then you have those characters here character eyes character so if you want to go back you can click there and then you go back and still have another character like um i'd like to start using those kind of character and i have this african boy so i can just click there if it is green whatever whenever you open what you see is this widows here and if you click then you can drag this character here and it will load on your PC so wait a bit and then we see okay so you have this character if you look at my window this a window here is missing and I can come here to window and then I click and then I just say like if you see this one is already ticked it's there the timeline you have everything timeline is here you have content manager we have screen manager we have modify is growth so you can press f6 or you press like this one, so you get this widow spark if you remember from yesterday I told you if I come here I like click and then I delete this character and the first of the first time I, I took this character from here and I dragged it. So this is what I did. Now there's another way I can click that character or that one. And then I say apply. And if you look at this window here, you see that this window is changing when the character is finished to load. So let's give it like two seconds. Take like two seconds here. And now your character is there. Uh, for zooming you can screw your mouse or you come here and you click here you still zoom You can also click here to drag this one you can move it from side to side Or you can click here To rotate the character If you want him to look side like this way So those things that you can you can try it on your own make sure when you're starting to admit your character here is always on preview sometime you can have i'll show you this later when I, I come to this process so let's see what we have we have this character here and now we have this one this table here if i click here i get another table where there are some things like how the motion puppet have dialect perfect if i click there and I drag this one here. Let me put it there. <coughs> uh, um, excuse me. So if I want to edit any of those bones, I can click here. And if I click preview. Uh, space. Okay. Uh, you can edit but I, uh, let me not do this okay uh, i want to show you something if i click like let me first of all put my character and i click there and i say here is told lot lock rotate and lock move so if you want to edit your character you can come here and edit this on the direct puppet if you want to edit i'll show you this one when we 
require them so let me first of all not do something about it so then here i have this one motion puppet this one i showed you also in my other video you can check on it and this is where you can animate your character if you click like you want to say your character um, let's say i want to say my character laugh me click here then i drag because what i'm interested in the face and then i click here and then i click the space bar and you see your character is moving and is also laughing so to stop you can click back again and your character will stop so if you want this motion to have on your video what you can do is that you can record this motion so that is one way then we had the, the motion edit i want to put this one here so that you can as uh, you can see so you have this one that is showing is showing you the bones those are the bones that can also be edited like if i click here you see i can rotate this bone to any side but i want to leave it the way same way it is right now then i have this one edit leash target this one is when you want to combine to and then you have this one mix motion and like we have um let's say this car start uh, i want to say let me first of all zoom him back a bit so that we can see him good and then i say lie and then i say maybe like sleep on the crowd and your character would automatically lie on the crowd so the animation is as simple as doing that way so you just need to click if you have the character most of those characters they are 3d and they are also animated so <coughs> uh, so i've showed you the mix motion for my character so if i take this one back my character will start up again and if i play here my character can sleep again good um make sure every time you are meeting that this one is at the end there so for the that was the body animation for the uh fascio or the fascio or the fascia you can have three things like you can have create script if you click there you can record like let's say if i want to make her talk i can click like on then i say okay record then i say hey my name is nick and then i say stop and say okay and now if i pray record, then i say hey my name is nick and i want to show you something um so if i move this character here look a bit shy and then i call and i say hey you see he's my name is speaking nick. but he has the, uh, also this other animation and that is something so if you don't need those animation you can right click your mouse and you come here and say remove object animation good so i also have like face puppet okay with this one you have to use the radio exit to fill up the explosion data okay I'll, I'll i'll show you that one on the, another video so if i click here tell me okay there so they are opening for me this one this one is where you can edit how your character look like most of those characters if you buy them if i do like that one i want to see this character like uh, this someone if i click open on my character there's something that is okay let me see uh 
I have to edit this character with three. I'll show you this one because it's also important. So um, this is mouth where you can add it if you need to make any change in your character. So now we have a fascio and now we have mobs. This one. Let's open and see. It's also loading. Let's give it like two seconds. This one is where you have to edit the net and everything. Now, if you are, uh, if you have the device that the mocha like the device that, like uh, Kintech, you can click here, and then you connect your device. I have one. I'll show you this on a separate video. There's something already opened. Let me close this one because. If you see here, there's this icon move creator. Let's give, so you have this character. So this one I've never used it. So I'll show you when I'll have to look at it and then I show you what you can do with it. So let's cross it first of all now i've shown you this table here modify if you click here you can change other like the skin if you want to see they are looking like here you can do them but i'll not do anything for my character for the moment so we have seen this one and we have seen the motions so the other thing that i wanted to show you like if you want to export your character to um sometime when you are making your character you find that they they are floating on the air if you find that one you can click here and you say that let your character it will automatically go to the zero level and blood or hard contact but for now this one i'll show you when a video when i had so many other things so you can tell your camera that you want to have to look on the camera when you're doing animation you see that he changed the face so if i click back yeah already only target the character set free of those one you can just tell them there you can make your character disappear if it you find your character disappear you can make them appear by clicking there or here if i click there the character will disappear if i click back the character will come back so now we have our character here if you want also to do animation you can come here this one the first one show you the character if i click here you see this this one africa dream and then you have all those characters like the one i have here i have the hand here I have the body parts and cloth and everything. I click here like I want to make cloth. There anything. If I want my character to have, I can come here and put. I don't think you take this cloth because he is not made to take those cloth. Yeah. Attempt to apply the body fade due to incompatible. Okay, good. Let me delete this character. Then I can come here. Oh. Good. Now I have this character here. And she is already dressed. So this is the character that uh, I like. So let's I come here. And then I want to add for her this animation. So if I click there, I can decide to drag this animation direct to her to be automatically. Or I click there, then I click plus. And this animation will be loaded on the icon and she will be animated. So if I put back. And then I pray. 
I forgot something. Not to stop. And then I remove this object animation. Like I said, if you want to do those kind of animation, you need a computer that is fast. So remove object animation. Then I come back and now I have to make sure that this one is here at zero. Then I add this animation double click. And then this animation will be added automatic. So I say equals. So now if I pray. Please have a seat. And let's start the class by trying to remember what we reviewed last week, what was covered, and your summaries about the lesson. As I am pretty sure that most of you do have an opinion about both sides of the story. So that animation was automatically added with the sound and everything. Now let's look at something here. I want to click this one and On this video not like to go deep about the timeline because um, this video was only meant for the animation so on the next video I'll try to go deep on timeline and try to make this character that we can have some other kind of animation and we can try to mix on it so I'll talk about this motion here like you can see there's a motion added the transform if you see here there's a dot and i um, hope because i've seen this character was moving back there must be you can be able so that this is the where the motion end so if i come here and i delete this one this character i think we only talk So let's now pray. Let's give our time to load. Now we can pray back. You see the character is moving, but she's not talking because here there is a we have deleted the motion, but this one transform switch is also there so if i come here i've deleted the switch and now this this character has no motion or cannot move even though i come here in a playback the character will only stay there so those are the things that i'm going to talk and uh they need time so i'll try to talk them deep on the timeline on how it works so that you can get to understand them thank you for watching this video and i'm expecting to see you on my next video have a nice day bye